Welcome to another brand new walkthrough. I'm your host, Freak of the Freaks with the JRPG community. So today we are playing Conception. That's right, people. We're playing the brand new walkthrough and we're playing Conception. There we go. Sorry about that. Uh, we're playing Conceptions. Uh, I am back on the Vita. That's right, I am back on the Vita playing Conceptions. Uh, they did not release a PlayStation 4 title. If they did, still playing the Vita. Prefer it. Oh my god. Anyway, we're back at it. So today we're going to play a new game. All right, today we're gonna uh, we're gonna put this guy's name because this is supposed to be his canon name. So, oops. There we go. How y'all doing though? Oh, let me turn on my beat up a little bit, just a little bit. All right, we get another anime cutscene. Cool it. The water is also um. Well, we'll, we'll get to what, what what this game's about. I'm I'm gonna let the game speak for itself. All right, we got the MC. Oh, the MC don't talk in this game, by the way. But that's it. That's, that's all I'm gonna say. So while I record this, one, I'm gonna record uh, Conception One Two, Conception Plus the um. Remake that came out in uh, 2019. What's that? Okay, I guess. <clears throat> what should we do? It's coming towards us. Hey, baby, I got this. I'm the hero. We'll have to fight. All right, I like enthusiasm, boy. Uh, boy, but. I got this. I'm the main character. Huh? But we don't have any weapons. Yeah, I don't. No problem. We are disciples after all. Okay, so show me what you got there, boy. Here goes. Eat this, monster. Oh, <laughs> oh what happened? I thought y'all were disciples. What happened, bro? I guess y'all not disciples. You got to suck so. Okay, my man, Clots. Man, this man, that's why I'm here. I'm the main character. Yeah, that's why you can't stand. That's why you paralyzed. Clots no, and Fuko. That, those are names. All right, another anime cutscene. Watch my man, main character, steps in to say today. Ooh, look at that! Look how cold my man looking. Look at him. Look at this. Look at him! Are you alright? Uh, yes. Bro, I like the way he said that. I like the way he said that. He said, Are you alright? Oh, my bad. You saved us. Man, you're really strong. Man, you know it. Thank you so much. I only just got to this place, and I thought I was already gonna die. Man, baby girl, without me. Fuko thanking him is good and all, but maybe you should at least stand up first. I mean, we can see up your skirt. No! <laughs> no way! I like Klaus already! He just started, like he was talking junk. And I rose up, I like him already. Huh? No! <laughs> you screamed louder than when 
you were being attacked by the monster. That's not true, but whatever. <laughs> Who cares about the underwear? I lend a hand. Good. Thanks. You okay? Can you stand, baby? Can you stand? Um, you're wearing that uniform. Does that mean? Yeah. I'm I'm awake. The bread of the star guys appeared in my hand. I just arrived in, on the silent. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. I'm Fuko. It's nice to meet you. So, like, are you, like, childhood friends or something? Yeah. Nice to meet you, too. It was amazing how you nice to meet you, too, monsters. too. Baby girl, don't Since sweat it. We've all been given the gift of the brand. We should follow your example. You should, you know it, baby girl. The Star God sure is cool. Yes, they are. That's kind of true. No. I thank him for the guard to the guard gods. Thanks to him, I've been given the power to protect the world. You're a good one, aren't you? Yeah, you know it, man. You know. Anyway, once we get to the city, we've got to go to the church to be tested, right? Why to the church? They'll tell us what rank of disciple our star energy makes us. I'm so nervous. Well, there's no doubt that I'm gonna be an S rank. Elite class all the way. Alright, I see you. You're going big, going hard. Isn't that the class of only the most distinguished disciples and leaders? Yep, that's right. Elites are the best of the best. That's why they're called elites. Hmm? What makes you sure you, you'll be the one, though? Well, it's in my blood, so... Never mind, it's nothing. Let's get going. Come on. I can't believe. All right, so you know we still finna do it. We still finna go to church. Chosen disciples, we stand in a branch of the church located at the center of the fort city. All right. I, Matero, am the high priest leading this church. Okay, cool. Nice to meet you, Matero. Is the high priest someone important? Yes, God. Yes. Oh my God. Ryuji all the way. This is Ryuji. Okay. Yes, he's important. I've heard that they're the most important people in the churches in each area. Yes. I guess that makes him pretty important then. Y'all suck. Now, first I must ask that you three show proof that you are indeed disciples. <sighs> indeed, you are all disciples. For the ah, last I twenty that. years, Damn. the people of the world have lived in fear of monsters. I believe there is no need to explain. But it is your duty to exterminate the creatures of dusk with your holy powers. Oh, fine, it's all I have. Hmm. I expect great things from you all. Um... What is it? This holy power only disciples have? Exactly what is it again? Okay, that's how you do it. That's how you do it. Damn. Good heavens. Didn't your school teach you anything? Damn, <laughs> he just roasted this man. You're like, what is it again? Listen closely. The dusk circles have been appearing in this world over the past 20 years. The monsters that poured forth from them raised havoc among the people. All right. These creatures could not be defeated with the meager amount of star energy we had. But the star god began to lend his might 
to a lucky few among us. In bestowing you disciples with holy power, he marked you with the star brand. All right, cool. Now, listen carefully. All right. The creation of the dusk circles is a direct result of man's growing desires. The first dusk circle appeared here on this island and represents our cardinal sins. Okay, cool. Accordingly, dusk circles representing the seven deadly sins appeared around the world. Well then, now you must go to the research lab to take your qualifying exams. All right. Ooh, it's finally time. I have high hopes that you will all be selected as the elite nemesis hunters. Hmm? Cool. It what are those? Those who hunt with vengeance. It's become a nickname for the elite class. As I have said, the qualifying exam is held at the Angel Marker R&D. All right, cool. Go there and seek out Chief Ruby, who is in charge of administering the examination. We'll do our best. All right, cool. My, we have some truly uh, <clears throat> well developed female disciples. Oh no, he did not say that. No, he did. Oh my God, no, he did not say that, <laughs> bruh, <laughs> bruh. You need to go to jail, dog. All right, we got some of that cold music. Let's see what it's talking about. That old kook is kind of fishy. You think so? Yeah, he's totally right. Even so, you shouldn't be asking basic questions like that to of a church at least. Have you ever attended class ever, wherever you grew up, Clock? <laughs> Do you want to test me? Go ahead, ask me anything. Sure. Well, nah, I'm oh. good. It's good, I understand now. Now that we all know that I did it, I did educate, let's head to the qualifying exam. Begin here. This is. So, this is. So, this is. Mm. I'm sorry, why don't I stop? Uh, it's me! So, this is where it's being held. Take your qualifying exam, right? It sure looks like the place. All right, cool. So, I'm in the past. You know, I'm in the past. Hey, excuse us. Hmm? Who may you be? We're here to take the the test. It's obvious who we are, bro. We got the uh uniforms. We are new disciples here to take the qualifying exams. New disciples. Oh, good. Welcome to Angel Marker R and D. I'm Mark, a researcher here. Nice to meet you, Mark. Nice to meet you. Chief Ruby, the disciples have arrived. Ah, oh, welcome. I'm the chief researcher here. My name is Ruby. Man, Ruby looking fine. Good stars. That is one smoking hot tomato. No, you did not. You said, God damn blind. Shut up. Clot, your inner thoughts are falling out through your mouth. You're an honest young man. Bruh, don't encourage her, baby girl. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh. Alright, that's funny. Oh. Ooh. Look at, look at, look at us. Hold up. Look at us. He like. Uh. I'm gonna class like, yeah. Seriously? Don't tease the new meat, Ruby. I know, I know. Damn. Materos told us about you. I've already confirmed your identities with your names and faces. I hope we get along. Oh, we do too. The fact is, you nice can do that. Let's see. That's some L. Oh, it's nice is to meet you. you like to know I mean, he already you said in. Sure. Nah, I don't have any questions. I'm alright. Let's move on to the qualifying exam then. Clots, you are first. Then Kuko, and you will be last. Oh, wait. Thank you. Oh. There, you're done. You are in the elite class, Clots. Your rank is B. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Damn. <laughs> Seriously? I'm not an S rank? No way. Yes, you're not. So sit down. Be quiet. That's still impressive. You're an elite. Don't you think so, too?
It's not that. <laughs> We're going to be savages. We're going to be savages. Say it like that. Let me add that your ether count is 60. Male disciples average around 50. So it is rather impressive. You're next, Pico. Come on into the simulator. I'll do my best. Impressive as all. She's a great deal of star. Amazing, Pico. You're not only an elite as well, but you're an S. Damn. Seriously? I, I know you, your pride. Your pride has to hurt off of that shit. <laughs> Alright, cool. Whoa. I'm glad for you, Fuko. Will I really be okay being an S rank? Well, that's up to you, baby girl. I so jealous. You're serious lucky. But I got that main character plot, so I should be good. Let me make it clear that luck has nothing to do with the disciples. Well, you're last. We've had a good run today, so let's finish this with Alright, cool. All right, cool. So if we take it for like a sign from the back, this is the weak point. <laughs> savage, we gotta be savage. We need. Damn it! <laughs> Sorry, dude. It's disappointing that I'm not S rank to be honest with you, but whatever. You know, I did better than my man's right here. That's all that matters. We're all elites. Don't start complaining about not being super on your first day. You're right. Well, I guess it's better to start working hard every way to increase my rank. Okay. You're kidding, right? This is over 30 times the average ether count. The ether detector can't take any more. Hmm. Hmm, what happened? Don't tell me. Is this boy? He has to be. He's the one the church has been waiting for. He's a god's gift. Huh? As you know, what? ether density is extremely low within dusk circles. That's why disciples can't use their star energy in them and can't fight properly. Because of this, we have only been able to intercept monsters that leave the circles. But your body is naturally exuding an incredible amount of ether. Okay. So much so that it's possible to create a battlefield within the dust circles. I bet. What's that? What do you mean? It means that you can fill the space around you with ether even inside the circles. So much so that you can use star energy there. If other disciples and star children are by your side, they can fight as well. All right, cool. That sounds great. It's the greatest ray of hope since the dusk circles were born. Really? I have that power? I've never even heard of such a thing until now. You should, you should really go to school, bro. There's never been a male disciple who created this much ether. 
Never. You truly are a gift from God. How could this happen? I'm the first one there. Man, I have some amazing classmates. Since you're a God's gift, I'm going to give you this. This is an ether amp. It's a special device that male disciples with high ether counts can equip. All weapons All right, cool. while using this will be strengthened further by your ether. That's so cool. I want one too, Chief Ruby. Your ether count isn't high enough to make it effective. Damn. <laughs> you won't get any result from having one. I... Oh. And Fuko, this is for you. These are dusk breakers. They're advanced weapons that compress the wielder's star energy into coherent energy. Damn, this thing don't get shit right in front of us. Wow, that's awesome. These are specially made for s rank disciples with high amounts of star energy. It wouldn't be an exaggeration to say that they've been made for people like you. Damn, why is we doing this right in front of my face? We just rolled to the oh, fuck out of it. such expensive looking weapons. One more thing about the ether amp and the dust breakers. This is an innovative feature, so I hope I don't gush over it too much. Activating it during battle absorbs holy power from the wielder's brand. It then envelops the user's body with a combat suit. In other words, it puts you into battle mode. Alright. 